guys i'm back again with a new video so in today's video i want to share with you my current makeup collection so i currently have four products to show you today it's it's all from the same brand which is misha so anyways i'm going to start now number one i have the makeup primer from misha it's the moist layering starter gold topping so this is a makeup primer and the packaging is made of glass so it looks expensive for me personally and it comes in a palm like this so it's easier for you to take the primer anyways the main ingredients in this primer is honey extract gold and hyaluronic acid this primer cl claims to moisturize the skin and prepare the skin before makeup and to give a more glowy and dewy look so the primer has a slight fragrance but for me it's not annoying at all and it does contain alcohol but for me it's not drying so anyways this is how the texture looks it's not creamy but it or runny it's like a aloe vera gel or like a lightweight essence after i blend it it's the gold flake disappear and as you can see it gives you like a shine after you apply it it feels light so usually in the morning i i can layer with other things as well so yeah anyways i really like this makeup primer because it looks nice with the gold flakes in it so yeah anyways i'm going to move on with new things uh with the art uh, with other item <laughs> it's it's the Misha Magic Cushion SPF 50 PA++++ So I bought this in shade N21 I, This is my first cushion so I'm not sure how to do the proper review But I'm going to read the product claim anyway So this is the cushion for blurring imperfection with a lightweight finish the formula effectively absorb excess oil and sweat and give you brighter healthier looking complexion so that is the product description so i've been using this for a few times now and i really like the sponge because the sponge is is bouncy i don't think you can see it here but when you tap it on your face it's very soft and feels nice and the sponge doesn't absorb a lot of foundation from the cushion so when you tap it using this sponge all the foundation is going to is going to go to your skin anyways this is how the cushion looks like As you can see, the sponge doesn't absorb a lot of product, so 
all the foundation goes into my skin and this is how it looks for me personally it feels very light and comfortable it doesn't feel like i'm wearing heavy makeup which i really enjoy because that means i can use another product later for example if i want to reapply my sunscreen it's not going to feel heavy on my skin it doesn't cover my redness but it helped brighten my skin overall so yeah i really like this cushion i think i need to try a lot more cushion so i can compare better but i think this one is not bad the misha magic cushion anyways moving on to the last product i have the misha perfect cover bb cream so i bought it a few months ago the small one and i decided to repurchase it again because i really like the bb cream but this time i bought a shade lighter because i want to see which one match my skin better because i buy it online so i cannot really test out the shade so anyways i'm going to swatch it to you the bb cream So the one, so this one, so the first one is N23, the second one is N21, I think it's only a slight difference but the N21 is lighter and the N23 is darker. This is how the BB cream looks after I blend it. So as you can see, it's, the BB cream makes your skin glow. I think you can see it from here. It's very shiny in real life. And I like it a lot. The BB cream has high SPF as well. It has SPF 42 PA++++. So if you buy the smaller one, it's got the packaging is going to look like this. You need to squeeze it out, but if you buy the bigger one, which is the 50 ml size, it's going, you're going to get like a pump, which I think is better because you won't because the amount that comes out is will be will be more calculated if that makes sense like you're not going to squeeze too little or too much if the packaging look like this anyways it's just a small thing but anyways, I think that's it for today. Thank you everyone for watching. I hope this video is useful. <gasps> Please subscribe if you don't mind. I'll see you guys again in my next video. Bye-bye.